started Oh, na na Why you gotta act so naughty? Try to blame ISIS and the terrorists. Right. 
before they start tackling all the hate, you know, going on abroad, they need to tackle the hate. We have right here just in the United States alone, we have so much hate. And it's yeah. not even just, you know, some people think that it's just about race or your gender. We have people that just hold hate, period. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because one thing is like this, teach stay home. Whether you like men, like women, trying to figure out what you like or what you don't like, everybody has it right now. I'm, I'll be the first one to tell you that I'm not necessarily can say that I agree with the life, but you do have a right to live the way that you want to. Right. And you also have the right to live. Just because you may not see a viewpoint the way that I see it does not mean that you deserve to die. And see, the thing is yeah. that straight off the bat, they try to come up, oh, he had psychological problems, he had this, he had that. He was a hater. You know, it is, is it possibility that he could have had psychological problems. We don't know. They said that but, he saw two people, two gay people kissing a couple of days before he did the shootout. Yeah, but he was a frequent, frequent, you know, clip over there. Oh. That's what they said. Yeah. Okay. They said that he was on. Um, so he was a DL and that's what it sounded like. He was okay. a down low. He, yeah, he had a wife, but and one of his lovers pissed him off. So that just, must have been. And um, he came back and probably did. I mean, you know, again, they're still trying to piece everything out to find out what happened. But you know, he died in that, so they can't ask him anything. But right. my thing is, why do they target all the gay people? Why they can't target pedophiles? Like, go blow up a building full of pedophiles. Yeah, 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 you're right, you're right about that, but you know what it is, I think that it's easier for them to target, because you know what it is, is that what also plays a part in it is media, because my thing is, is that, like, alright, if you look at things from back in the days where it wasn't, you know, say the gay, you know, it's a gay and lesbian community. They were out there, but it wasn't so broad with TV, and you know, now you have kissing on TV, and I mean, this all fun. Well, you have to bring that point across. But what it is is that for all of those people who never really were out there saying that I don't like the situation, I don't like to see gay men, you know, gay men kissing, or I don't like to see lesbian women kissing. It's I feel like sometimes the media fuels. The tension in between, instead of bringing it to right, we like. For instance, um, I saw it right after, oh, right after, right after that. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's we got a caller. Okay. Yes, call on the air. State your name and where you from. Yo, what's going on? This is Ty from Harlem. What's going hey, on? Ty. Hey, what's going on? Casey Love. Let's give my girl Casey Love a shout out. Uh oh, uh oh. Great, great, beautiful, talented young lady. Uh oh. You know, I, I, I listen, I'm going to chime in on what you guys just talking about. You know, yeah. Me personally, I've been on this man. I'm uh, going to run the investigation three times. Uh, mm. I feel like once you meet that criteria of, uh, you know, terrorism or, or any kind of terrorism you know, of any sort, you know, stuff should be taken here. Yeah, he still kept his gun license. Uh, right. He was in Florida. Right. And local authorities and he was there or not. Like, you know, I mean, I know he's got a lot of ISIS out there happening, but, I mean, he, he, he's crazy all over the world, man. And, and, and you know, uh, for me, I feel like the government not that ball, man. You know, now, uh, they, they put it all on him. Like, you know, it was more than size. It's always, it's always more than size in certain situations, especially right, right. home, man. You know, so. You know, at the end of the day, you know, you know, God bless those people and God. Right. Just, at the end of the day, you know, they have to make right with their lifestyle. Uh, yeah. I, 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 you know, I'm a black man in, 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 in the city, and you know, I, I don't judge people because people judge me. You know, like people you know, go around me and give me as a thug, a street dude, and I'm a homie, and kids and all that. You know, I don't have to, you know, people have to look past that and move on with their lives. So everybody has the right to live with what they want to be with a man and be with a woman. They want to go transition from a man to a woman, go to a man, they want to know, so we just got to live with him and, you know, live, love, and laugh. Yeah. That's it, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. But listen, guys, I just want you to know that I'm a supporter of you guys, that you love with one of my best friends, you know, when, uh, you know, appreciate that. Definitely. I'm going to have my guys up with my, 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 uh, Facebook and all that, promote you guys as much as I can. You know, uh, Casey Love, you got a dope radio voice. Uh, I, 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 you know, uh, but I'm Thank you. Uh, you know what? We're going we to give you a chance to give a shout out to whoever you want right now. 